there's so many things that are fascinating about Carmel Place. If you're at the street level, you definitely see this beautiful new residential building on East 27th Street in Manhattan. Stunning architecture. It's a building that now has great ground floor uses, so it's really activated the street experience for everyone who walks around there. You see these surrounding parks now opened up. You see a building that has opened up new streets that were previously closed. But what's not immediately clear, it's kind of uh, hidden in the walls of Carmel Place, is that it's actually a laboratory for housing innovation in New York. In 2012, the Bloomberg administration decided to test some of these ideas coming out of the Making Room Research Initiative um, and test them really in the marketplace. Well, first of all, we were excited for a lot of reasons when we won the RFP. We thought it was compelling because it gave us an opportunity to do th something that was novel and potentially transformative in terms of reintroducing a product type that could really deliver better choices for people in the city. One of the advantages of modular construction is the lion's share of the work is done off-site. And so the idea of keeping disruption to local residents to a minimum really played well. What is, was always surprising to us is kind of looking at the unit, being in the unit versus looking at the plan. When you look at the plan, it looks small. When you're inside, it feels big. The way we thought about how to make something feel bigger than it is, um, is we created different zones. There's the bathroom and kitchen, and then there's the living space. And then there's basic principles of maximize the windows. We were lucky to be able to have much taller ceiling heights than what is typical in a rental apartment. So in that added ceiling height, we put linear storage. I'm Dario Hamler Luciano. I've been here for a year and it's been in incredible. My living situation before coming here, I was homeless at the time. I was living in a shelter for three months. When I got here to Carmel Place, right, I felt relieved. I felt that I have come out of um, a shadow that it wasn't, I wasn't meant to be, right? For me, that's been a blessing, a sanctuary. 